Hi guys, I'm Alex and in this quick video I will show you how to replace the solid state disk or the RAM or the battery um, of this 2019-2020 HP ProBook with the AMD CPU. So let's begin. Shut down the laptop and remove all the screws. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven screws. I am already removed some screws and they're using different type of screws. In the front the small one, here and here, and this screws for the other five. So um, now I'm removing the last one screw here. A little bit tricky. So, and in the front the last screw here. Now you can use a plastic card to open this laptop. Grab here, be very very careful. And now you can open this laptop. So So, now you can see the laptop. Here you have two slots for up to 32 GB of RAM. In this uh, notebook is uh, 8 GB of RAM, DDR4 included. So I upgraded this laptop with 16 gigabytes more, so we have 20 gigabytes of RAM. It's very easy. You can plug in this um, RAM here. So, and clap. I'll show you once more. Voila. So, if you want to replace the battery, you have to you have one, two, three screws. I removed it. One, two, and three. One. So, and this is the type number, you can see it here, here, they're using different types, and now you can see, here is the BIOS battery, this is a simple battery, you can buy it from eBay or Amazon, or, and this is connected here and you can replace this, be very careful and it's a little bit tricky and I'm plug in the battery back. So now you can also see here is the touchpad. If you want to replace the touchpad, one, two, three, another screw here, four, five, six screws, and this cable here, and you can replace the touchpad. So, but we want to replace the solid state disk M.2 with a solid state disk from. Samsung with one terabyte. So I open this screw here and you can unplug the solid state disk and insert the 
Samsung Solid State Disk. So I show you the RAM. This is the original RAM, 8 GB, DDR4, 2666 RAM. Back. You can also see the CPU is fixed on the motherboard. You can't change the CPU, but you can you can change the fan. It's very easy. Remove this uh, this screw here and unplug this cable. Be very very careful. So, and now, oh, this is a screw. This is the fan. So here is the part number, service part number. Oh, you can see it here. And now I'm putting the fan back. So here, here put back the fan cable and put back the screw. So now, oh, here is the screw. So perfect. So, and my customer has a old um, solid state disk from Samsung and we use this slot here and upgrade this laptop with the second hard disk or solid state disk. So plug in here. Normally you can use a, a special case. Um, I don't use this case, so with the solid status it's, it's okay. So, so now put back the battery, check if the BIOS battery is connected, every cables are now connected. Um, what's, what I can show you, so the, the, you can see the keyboard is fixed on the top cover. Better if you want to replace the keyboard, replace the complete top cover is the best idea and yeah that's it now put the battery back one two three this screw here another screw here One, two, here is another screw. So now we changed the M.2 solid state disk. We added a second solid state disk. Put back the bottom cover and check all the cables. And voila, here, uh, here you can see the wireless LAN card, the Wi-Fi card, if you want to replace them. And if you have any questions, type write me a comment and goodbye.